Hi friends, welcome to my another video, today we gonna showing you best long life battery laptop you can get from market. Let's see the first. First one is Samsung Notebook 9. The Samsung estimates about 9 hours of battery life out of this, it is a full 360 degree convertible laptop from Samsung. This is a 13.3 inch full HD touch display. And you get a nice and easy to use lightweight tablet. And it throws in Samsung's signature Sone technology, it has the latest 8th generation Intel Core i processor up to 16 GB RAM. And 256 GB of SSD storage. Samsung has still packed in a full complement of ports. IT has an HDMI ports and it has USB C, and it has a full headset audio jack, and it also even has a full-size USB a port and micro SD card slot and a power button, Samsung also HASNT skimped on security, this has the full Windows Hello security suite, it has a pair of IR cameras up top for facial reasons. The second one is Microsoft Surface Book. The Surface Book is billing it as the ultimate laptop. The Microsoft says you expect up to 13 hours battery life, either. Way to you get two batteries, one in the tablet itself and one in the keyboard. Microsoft says you expect up to 13 hours, that's a reference to the, the premium build as well as the fast performance long battery life and convertible design. On the outside IT has a well-built magnesium cassock with a comfortable keyboard and Microsoft own precision touchpad. Basically the best Windows trackpad you can get. All told it looks faintly like a MacBook Pro and performance like one too, it is a funky looking hinge that allows you to attach the screen by holding down a button on the keyboard. Once you can remo, it you have an incredibly light 13.5 inch tablets, really it's incredible how light this is it weighs just 3.34 pounds and its screen weighs is 1.6 pounds and it is super thin but remember there, SA full functioning core i5 PC in there. If you want you can also attach the screen facing backward and then flip it down into tablet mode, it perform like a 1 2, under the hood you get either 6. Generation Core i5 or i7 processor paired with 8 or 16 gigs of RAM up to 512 gigabytes of SSD storage and an optional NVIDIA GPU, I benchmarked it both with and without discrete graphics but even without it's fast, I says that's conservative estimate, I actually go around 14 with INTE GRETED graphics. Third one is Lenovo Yoga 920. The Lenovo says you can expect nearly 12 hours of battery life. The Lenovo 920 carries over the signature watch band image of the Yoga line, which lets you smoothly transition between laptop, stand and tent, and tablet modes. IT has a 13.9 inch, 4K IPS display, weighs in at just 1.37 kg, and is a meter 13.95 mm thick. I. Inside all of that you'll be able to configure with up to an Intel Core i7 8th generation processor and 16GB of RAM, and spacious 1TB SSD, it also have active pen support with 4096 levels of pressure sensitivity. With fetting a modern laptop, the Yoga 920 is rather spartan with its port, on the left you'll find a pair of USB-C Thunderbolt 3 ports and the audio jack while the right side has a single USB 3.0 port. And the power button, some people have complained about the odd placement of the right shift button on the previous model, which was to the right of the up arrow key, a far, field microphone has also been added so that Cortana can respond to voice comments from up to 4 meters. Fourth one is LG Gram 15 The Lenovo says to you expect up to 10 hours of battery life, this is LG Gram which is thin and light notebook usually remarkably thin I. N light LG Gram series gets its name from the fact dot that they hadn't weigh about a kilogram and this is probably in smallest model today. Thanks to very slim bezels around the screen, so it's got a 13i. NCH display but it's more the size of a typical 11 or 12 notebook. Thanks to these very thin bezels it also has a touch screen display which is relatively new for this series, and you can see that the Wii. VCAM is actually above the screen unlike some computers, which puts it below the display in order to save space on the top bezel it weighs, just about 2 pounds IT almost feels like a toy, now that's so. Nothing that you're going to want to take with a grain of salt it is sort of mobile mark result, we got a micro SD card slot here USB, and headset jack HDMI USB, and 3 type C, and USB 3 it's got a middle STD, 8 nanogram spec tested case and actually the double check that is a Thunderbolt 3 port there so that's just sort of a quick hand underscore on its nice looking machine it feels pretty good, it's device that should very easily get all day battery life. And of course it does have this 8th generation Intel Core i7 i3 or 8 volts processor option, so that's the LG Gram the 2018 model.
fifth one is Acer Chromebook 14. Acer says you can expect 12 hours of battery life, the first thing you will notice is that it is the first laptop to use Corning, yo! The new vibrant Gorilla Glass cover and this allows the company to actually print photos directly onto substrate, and it keep it really hardy and resistant to cracks and breaks. But it has a really UNIQ. You look and a lot of people going to really like that opening, this up though is where things get interesting you have a 14 inch full HD display and inside, you have up to a 6th generation Skylake base 4 i Intel processor. We also have a spill resistant keyboard which is really handy, if you're ever been as clumsy as, I haven't broken a laptop because you spilled a cup of cough on IT, in at it. Buy onto that this is military standard grade protected, which means that you can drop this room up to 48 inches and it's not going to get damaged, and this is very rebossed plastic on the bottom 4 GB of RAM. Which is some of the longest in the Chromebook space, this is aimed at the enterprise market and as a result it's certified for Chrome for Work which is Google's business and enterprise initiative which allows it administrative to push certain limitations certain extension and certificates to employees out of business.